Okay, <clears throat> so here's what we got is I broke my air pipe, the Stearman, and I'm having to replace some broke parts. So this bushing right here goes into the cabane strut. That cabane strut is cleaned and primered already. Got it fixed up. It's aluminum. Uh, it's got some plates that are riveted. Not sure if you can see that in there. Uh, uh, focus. 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 Uh, it's got some plates. There it is. Got some plates in there that are riveted uh, onto it. And then these shoulder bushings, which are steel, and they're not aluminum, go in there and then a bolt goes through it. This protects from crushing the aluminum. The issue is, is that these bushings, shoulder bushings, are steel and they will rust up. The aluminum, not so much. So what I've done, and uh, what I'm in the process now of doing, is to order some Caswell, from Caswell, some black oxide kit, and we're gonna give this thing a shot. So here's the box, I did open it up, but I haven't got into it yet, so it's just been open, and we'll see what happens. Um, take a packing off of it. And let me see if I can get this thing set up here somewhere where we can see. Sorry, it's a lot of jerking. I gotta get me a go for a little stand. Just haven't yet, so just deal with it for right now. Uh, get the packing out of it. And we got more packing. Uh, ooh, two buckets. So I got a rinse and a maybe that storage bucket. Not sure. And that's that. We'll set the packing aside. We came with two buckets. We have ooh, the silk. What are the other jerky holidays? Okay, and we'll set our buckets over here to the side too, and let's see what we got here. Penetrating sealer, one quart. Penetrating sealer, one quart. And the black oxide concentrate. So I read through the directions earlier. And what it's said to do. was one to nine with the concentrate. So you need to go one to nine or whatever volume that I'm wanting to do. And I'm wanting to do these bushings. So I won't be using that whole pipe. It'd be a wasteful. I do have the buckets here. And it says I thoroughly cleaned them uh, by sandblasting. So I have wire brushed and cleaned out the inside. Actually, I did a neat little trick is um, put the bushing on a half inch drill bit because that's half inch and then put it, the drill bit there and then put it against the wire wheel. So what it did on the drill bit is it cleaned the inside of them. I'm not sure if I can oop, there it did. clean the inside of them and also the exterior which was kind of cool. So. All I gotta do now is get all my fingerprints off of them. And with some Comet, I'm gonna have to go shopping. And I'm needing some, uh, I don't wanna call it sieves, but something 
that I can use the bucket with and and then put all these components inside it which is like a parts cleaner uh, tray if I could do that and utilizing the bucket right there and then just dip my parts put my parts in a sieve and then drop them down in there and then do them all at once instead of one at a time. That's my plan. I need to go shopping and see what I can come up with. Okay, and I will continue this in a bit. So we'll see how it goes.